Ufunguzi wa ghafla wa shule huenda ukaadhiri wanafunzi pakubwa kiakili hasa wanapojaribu kuzoea mienendo mipya ya kutangamana shuleni. You left school in March. You're coming to school in October. Things are totally different. Your desk mate is not so close anymore. When you used to ask for rubbers, do you now ask for a rubber? Do you ask for a pencil? Do you need to sanitize the pencil? You see there are so many other questions that come up. <laughs> Kulingana na ripoti kutoka kwa shirika la Save the Children zaidi ya asilimia tisini ya wanafunzi hawakupata fursa ya kuendeleza masomo yao mitandaoni hivyo basi huenda ikachukua muda kumakinika darasani. So it comes very difficult. The, I think the teachers what they can do for them is maybe when they join they go to school maybe day one, if it is on Monday let them sit down with them and just ask them what are your fears? What do you and vision and have this conversation with them and also do activities that can distress them Kulingana na Elizabeth Mutunga ambaye ni mwanasaikolojia idadi kubwa ya wanafunzi walijitosa kwenye shughuli mbalimbali zilizohusiana na masomo kama biashara na kwa hivyo huenda ikachangia kwa baadhi ya wanafunzi kutorejea shuleni pesa ni tamu lakini sasa sababu lazima urudi shule na lazima uh, usome lazima lazima kuwe na give and take kuna lazima utapoteza moja ndio u benefit kwa hiyo ingine. so lazima pia wazungumziwe sababu wengine wanaweza ta opt kutoka shule kuvunjwa kwa ratiba iliyokuwa hapo awali ya kalenda ya shule huenda kukaadhiri wanafunzi ambao hawana budi ila kuzoea ratiba mpya itakayowalazimu kuwa darasani mwezi wa Disemba uliozoeleka kama mwezi wa likizo na sherehe chungu nzima the teachers need to really work with them encourage them give them an avenue where they can speak even if it's bringing in maybe a counselor to speak to them it's important because we need to prepare them psychologically for the new normal and how it's going to move forward kulingana na mutunga walimu wanatarajiwa kujitwika jukumu la kuwashauri wanafunzi kuhusiana na marekebisho ya ratiba na hata kuwaelimisha jinsi ya kutangamana kwa nidhamu ili kuzuia msambao wa virusi vya corona shuleni ni vizuri pia mwalimu akwe mtu ambaye watoto wanaweza zungumza na ye, mtu wa karibu na think hata kama mzazi ukiona mtoto wako pengine ame develop homa pengine usimpeleke shule for now until uko sure si corona lakini pia kuna wakati mwingine mtoto wako hako sawa lakini anaenda shuleni mwingine hako na homa anapata homa so kuwe na systems ambao walimu wanaweza uh, ensure that Eh, wana confirm si corona lakini ni homa ya kawaida na watoto wanaendelea huku wanafunzi wa darasa la nne la nane pamoja na kidato cha nne wakitarajiwa kurejea shuleni siku ya Jumatatu ni matumaini kwa wazazi kuwa afya ya wanao itakuwa salama socializing is very important so now we, it, they have to social distance they cannot do activities together so that has an effect on them psychologically because you you are united by being part of the team but now it's going to be very different so yes there will be psychological effects a lot of them may be even scared of even even going back to school there are those fears jijina magundu k24 weekend